Yeehaw! And welcome back to Red Axe Snack and Favorite Reviews. And today we've got the Culver's uh, Pretzel Hoss Burger. I believe is the name. Exciting stuff here. Um, so basically it's a pretzel burger with bacon, cheese, cheese sauce, pickled onions, and mustard sauce. So definitely an interesting sandwich for sure it's got a lot on it um last time i had a pretzel sandwich pretzel burger type of thing it was from wendy's it was all right but i have high expectations for culver's you know culver's is a great restaurant and i believe i have their burger ranked over wendy's in general anyways so a lot, lot, lot to look forward to here so before we get there, please like, comment, share, and subscribe. And check out my Instagram, Redneck Snack of Food. Yeah, we're just going through this real quickly. Um, we've got things to do, places to be. Driving all around North Carolina. I don't have a Culver's back home. I'm from Virginia. So, out and about exploring, my friends. So, here's the burger. I hope you're excited to watch this. And let's get on in. Mmm. That piece of bacon was so good. So, they have it where, um, like the generic one would be the double. I just did the single. Um, I probably would recommend the double, but again, I'm eating a lot today, so I'm trying to hold back a little bit. But so far, I do like the mix of flavors. We've got like cheese, mustard, uh, pickled onions, and those are kind of having like a strong aftertaste with the beef and the pretzel bun and the bacon. It's it's a very good savory sandwich. The, the pretzel bun definitely has good notes of pretzel flavor from the outside to within the bread. Mm. It's definitely a lot of flavor. I think the onions, they, they kind of conflict me. I wish they weren't so strong. They have such a strong hold on this thing. Um, but other than that, like, I love the mix of flavor. Like, you got the mustard, you got sweetness, savoriness, just a nice sandwich. Nice and fresh. I probably would prefer just their normal burger, um, just because it's had a lot going on. But it definitely is interesting. It brings a different vibe to the game. Um, and it, it's just like, it's a different thing you can get. But for me, it, it's solid. I just would say probably get another beef patty on it. Kind of would uh, balance out the flavor for more, a, a bit more. Um, not make it this overly flavorful beast that it is. But I'll give it a seven and a half. I think it's enjoyable. I think it's worth trying, especially if you like pretzel buns, especially if you like the mustard. Of course, you can get things taken off of it. You can get things put on there. So maybe if you don't like what you're hearing about these pickled onions, just tell them you don't want pickled onions. Simple as that. But I hope this review gave you enough information where you decide if you wanted this or not. Um, they also, I don't know, and there's anyone that likes to go try out like their new uh they got little uh scoops of ice cream that they do a daily like scoop i don't know if anyone of y'all like to do that and go try it but they do have a new one um and you'd have to check online to see if it's out for the day but they have a new daily flavor the salted caramel pecan and um of course i wanted to try it but there's only one location and again i just need to prioritize where i'm spending my time today so that's not happening um but 
I did have the brownie one, and it was all right. I, it, I'm not a huge brownie batter overload kind of fan. You know, I'm more into like candy and cake and other things. Brownie's all right, but it was pretty good. It had good. It just didn't feel like it had enough in it. So then that might just be the scoop I got. Could be the location, but this location's been pretty good too. So. They still have the uh, concrete, the, the cobbler concrete. It's basically just granola pieces mixed in with fruit. Um, they got a lot of good things. They definitely have a good menu. They had cheese curds. I got that on the side. I'm going to finish those um, once I'm done with this review. But definitely check Culver's out. Definitely a good place. Definitely a good burger. Seven and a half. A lot going on. So maybe get the double if you can handle it. But today I've just decided I got to gotta prioritize everything and so been trying food out and i enjoyed doing this review and i hope you enjoyed watching and i will see y'all around yeah